guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new WWE Supercar video, episode 147. We have got Battleground, King of the Ring, and potential um, RTG preview, Team RTG preview, sorry. So let's get on with that. First of all, we're going to start off with Ring Domination. <clears throat> so in the last video, guys, or the one before that, you saw me get Alistair Black. Um, I did start working on Luke Harper. I think I saw that you guys saw that in a video. We managed to get him. Uh, which will be catalogued for me. I already had a single, um, needed a pro. For some reason, I'd got rid of that. I got rid of that single, so I need to get another Luke Harper for it to be a pro. But that will be catalogued, so that is okay. That's good. 18 minutes till that is over, um, and then they'll obviously they'll still be up. But yeah, preview for the RTG hopefully up tomorrow. So let's move on on to King of the Ring. I'm in the semi-finals. I'd won the first game, and we're 20 minutes away from the second game, and it's looking very, very promising. Please don't jinx that touch wood, but it's looking very promising. Um, it's been a great King of the Ring. One of my favorite, like one. It's it's been a really awesome King of the Ring with the people in it. Have been really nice being in it with the Beast, who's in my team's awesome, and lots of awesome people in the chat. So I'd like to give a huge, huge shout out to someone in the chat, if we go in King of the Ring right here, uh, SPC Preston, um, let me just get the name, sorry didn't remember, where is it, I think it's higher up here, where is it, no I think it's all the way down here, never mind, sorry, but it's worth it, there we go, Alright, it's all here. Kogami, I just wanted to say, my son is a big fan of yours. He was really excited when he saw my name uh, watching you. Can you give Tyler Day a shout-out for me? So, Tyler Day, a huge shout-out to you, man. Uh, big ups to everyone in this King of the Ring. The Beast. Um, whereas, Dancers with Dudley as well. Big shout-out to him. He's been great in this King of the Ring. Looks like we're going to meet up in the final. And, uh, and yeah, it's been an awesome King of the Ring. So, for once, I actually have a memorable King of the Ring. Why not shout that out? We move on into Team Battleground. Uh, I've already done a couple of attacks against Battle... Sorry, bat, bat, Battle Leg Play. This is going to be an easy win, guys. I'm, I'm not trying to be... You know, it's only been like six minutes, and I'm not trying to be arrogant, but it is going to be an easy win. As you can see, pretty much none of them have... Uh, no, yeah, exactly. Easy win, as you can see. None of them are charged fully. So, um, yeah, it's it's not a shame. I'm not going to say, oh, yeah, it's a shame, you know. You know, you're playing Supercard, you have a lot to do in the game already. It's not easy for teams to just play Battleground after Battleground. And, um, you know, get the, it's, not, it's not easy, so I can obviously understand it. It's good for us. People who actually do play are going to get rewarded with this game mode, so that's a good thing. And, uh, yeah, I'm overall really happy with, uh, with how it's turned out. It will have obviously some really close matches. Uh, hopefully, we do get paired up with some uh, some good teams out there. Maybe some uh, teams from other YouTubers. That'd be awesome. But if we do get paired up against teams like this, you know, we're not gonna we're not gonna complain because it's just a free WrestleMania card, and uh, and we'll take it. So yeah. Um, so yeah, let's keep getting these points. That's another win for us. I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure who we attacked there, but he might have been for a bit lower points. But it doesn't matter if I get the points or. Other team members get the points. Look, um, my t my deck's not really good at all. Just getting these points on these high uh, high people is uh, is going to be good for us. Well, good for me at least, because with my deck, you know, I should have been attacking a bit lower so I can get a bit more points for my team, which is all good. We were pretty much all charged up. Um, pretty pretty much all charged, I think. Two or three people were on like a hundred and ten. Um, which, you know, that means like every single card charges except from like one hardened. Um, so for people who can't play um, and get the 120 charges, so here's a little tip for you guys. What you want to do is obviously you want to level up your better cards um, quite a bit. But between, between like the lower cards, level them up a little bit. Make sure both of your females are leveled up because you're not just looking at your when your card's attacking. Like, you're not just looking at that, you're also going to want to try and make sure when people attack you, that you can defend. So, like, make sure both of your females are leveled up, that's really important. And then, make sure, if obviously possible, that you're th at least three of your males are fully charged. And if you have, like, the fourth one is, like, a hardened, 
you don't really need if like you can't play leave that one make sure it's that one you leave and not one of your second females because obviously you have the female tag so it's that's my opinion to you guys but yeah so let's see what we got in the chat REP team battle like play yeah um, but shout out to them though yeah huge shout out to them again you know it, it is what it is they're they're obviously you know a uh, I think they're a hardened team so uh, it makes sense that you know as we're in WrestleMania plus 33 plus plus team that we've just got the more active members in it you know that's how it is that's how it is uh, let's attack that guy yeah we'll keep attacking the top guys as long as we can we've got a couple attacks We'll maybe get through all of our all of these attacks in the video. Um, if team, yeah, hopefully Team RTG is going to be a pro for me. Um, been getting quite unlucky recently with the Shinsuke Nakamura Battleground Rewards, the Bray Wyatt in the Ring Dom after just getting a pro in the last Battleground Rewards before that. So um, overall, not not great. The last like week, five days, uh, getting those two Baron Corbins, getting a support. Um, yeah, it's it's been going down my luck. So hopefully we can get that back up with a, a good pro, hopefully or a single. I would obviously take a single of a, of a card that I've never gone before, not of a card I've gotten a pro of. A Kevin Owens, a Sami Zayn, um, an Undertaker, John Cena. I'm pretty sure that's about it. I'm missing. So yeah, any of those, any of those. Uh, let's keep attacking this Rot Mama guy. Okay, I can't attack him. Let's attack Freddy. That's fine. So I'm pretty sure is is every single person on their team like is none of them fully charged at all, or has any of them got at least one card fully charged? Because if not, I mean, you know, you should be getting. I can, you know, as going back to what I said before, it's gonna sound a bit, you know, a bit of a hypocrite, but you know, I mean. I, as I said, I can understand people who can't get charged on every single card, but if you can't get like one or two of your cards fully charged, I mean, I don't know. I'm not sure like, you know, what teams you're in, if, you know, if you're in, it, probably not an active team if, if you aren't fully charged, I don't think. I'm not saying fully charged, I mean at least having one card charged or something. So I, I'm not sure how active this team is. Okay, three picks. We're gonna probably get a reset here. Rare Triple H, great. <laughs> yeah, D2 got a WrestleMania 33 Triple H the other day. So, well, yesterday actually. So, yeah. Good. GG, GG D2. <laughs> uh, it's only a single for him. So, as you can, none of the lower people have been attacked yet. None of them. That's hilarious. That is pretty funny. So, well, actually, no. So yeah, he doesn't seem to be active. This guy seems to be decent because he's got yeah he got level nine, level ten on every card. So it's those kind of things that I disagree with. Kind of, um, he should have definitely like that Dean Ambrose. It's it's the fourth. Um, it's your like your fourth card. It's the weakest card. It's not going to call it often. Just focus on getting your Titan and your Triple H Seth Rollins because this guy's got really good deck. If it had been fully charged, not many of us could have beaten him at all. So so yeah. Um, so yeah, nothing on him. He's like that. He's nothing on Freddy. Cabby, sixteen in total, and everyone else is hidden. Okay, all right. Let's attack the top guy. Almost five thousand points already. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. But yeah, guys, I will end this video at the end of this attack because it's just going to be pretty much the same thing. Me getting easy wins against um, not leveled up cards. You see two ultimates here. Obviously, that would have easily been able to beat me if it was fully charged, but it hasn't. So this will be uh, win number five, I believe. So that's good. We were in the top, we're still, I think, just in the top 100. We kind of dropped out a little bit from the last win because we didn't get too many points. Um, it, it's good if you get 13,000 around there. It's much better if you get, if you try and push to like the 15,000s, the high 14,000s. That's what we need to try and be getting every battleground. So anyway, let's get our picks, see what that brings us up to, see who's uh, been playing, who's been attacking. Be beautiful graphics again, I haven't mentioned it too much, but these battleground graphics have been uh, like, are awesome, really awesome. So anyway, there we go, another 107 points, takes us up to pretty much 
5,000. I am not even top of the team. Wow. Um, God, Fatboy's been attacking. Nick's been attacking. All right. Good, good, good. VZH hasn't even attacked, and he's got the best. Oh, and VZH has been attacked, and they lost. They clearly lost, as they've got no points on the board. So they've only used one attack, and it came from their top guy, who didn't even bother once to charge. Yet yeah, he has time, 15 minutes later, to use an attack. Shorts. <laughs> okay, then. Um, I'm guessing they didn't even really bother. Maybe they just saw a team and was like, oh, no point. I don't know. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Um, actually, no, wait. I'm ending this episode now, but I'm not even sure if there will be a second part to this. This is for t this is tomorrow's video, guys. It's technically is Monday today. It's like 3 a.m. right now. So I'm pretty sure I'll, I'll add a part to this, guys, which will probably be the preview to the RTG, the Team RTG, that is. So I'll say thank you guys for watching the first part. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in just a bit. Yo guys, welcome back to episode 147. We have got a guaranteed WrestleMania 33 pull coming up in King of the Ring. Um, so it has finished. I think I showed you guys this, that I was in the semi-finals, I think, or that I was in the... I'm not too sure, but I think I showed. Um, but yeah, let's go back into it really quickly and see that we lost the final 2-0 to Dancers with Dudley. So congratulations to you, man. You'll be getting that extra ultimate card. I really am not too bothered about it because I am getting a WrestleMania card and that is what matters. Yes, ultimate cards can be useful if it's catalog for me, but <sighs> WrestleMania card. So let me quickly show you guys all my singles that I have. Um, you know, from now onwards, every time you see me getting rewards like this, I am going to hope uh, for a female. And it's going to be the same thing today. We're looking for females. The dream would be Sasha Banks. But anyway, um, Goldberg, Triple H, Brock Lesnar, Samoa Joe, Seth Rollins, AJ Styles, Bailey, Chris Jericho, Sasha Banks, the one, the chosen one, uh, Rusev, Ty Dillinger, Neville, Dean Ambrose, The Miz, Naomi would be a good one, Rich Swan, Ken Shamrock, I suppose. I'd probably end up silver starring it, to be fair. Finn Balor. Uh, God damn, please don't give me a Bray Wyatt or a Shinsuke, please don't. Uh, Brian Kendrick would be, and uh, that's pretty much it. I would take a single as well, a female or a male single I would take. So let's get into this right now. We're going to go ahead and claim our rewards. That is a fucking awesome reward. Now it is a single, but... I'm fucking happy with that single, Undertaker, WrestleMania 33. So I've got now, I'm only missing John Cena in the top five now, and I've got the bet. That's awesome. That's so, so fucking cool. I know one person will be jealous. That is Flame. Flame will be really jealous of that. So that is pretty fucking sick. WrestleMania, that picture though, that picture. Um, out of all the superstars, that picture is the one... Um, I, I, I thought it looked the nicest out of all the Wrestlemania cards. So what we're going to do right now is we are actually going to go swap that on the catalogue. That now means I'm missing Kevin Owens, Roman Reigns, Sami Zayn, and Kevin Owens. Roman Reigns, Sami Zayn, John Cena, Kevin Owens, yeah? That's, all, that's it, apart from like a couple females. But anyway, Undertaker, where are you? You're right at the end, aren't you? No, it went too far. You're right at the bottom. There we go. Set as champ. How does that picture look? That picture looks pretty sick, actually. I think it looks pretty awesome. So that's King of the Ring done. That was worth it. Um, so yeah, definitely worth it. We're going to lock that card in as well. But WrestleMania, Undertaker, I'm a little bit still quite surprised from it. You know, I just wasn't expecting to get that. Um, so I'm, I'm quite happy with that. We'll lock it in. And that is a single, but hey, really good single. Really happy with that. Brilliant. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Um, the next episode will be containing some team RTG, but it is for Randy Orton, as you can see by the cover of it. And I'll skip for well, Actually, let's just go through all of these. Stardust, Seth Rollins, Bret Hart, Zack Ryder, Sami Zayn. Chad Gable, Rusev, Ty Dillinger, and Orton. So, Sami Zayn is the only SummerSlam I've ever gotten pro'd. Chad Gable 
Um, got I got Jason Jordan as my Harden freebie. I think Elite Rusev. I oh, don't really care. Um, Ty Dillinger must have gotten about five pros of when the um, team ring domination glitch back in Ultimate Tier happened, and then Randy Orton. It's already a pro. This is now the second time it's happened to me with the Bray Wyatts. Every time I get a pro. So basically, apart from Bobby Roode, all my battleground rewards have been pretty shite, if you think about it. Actually, apart from Brock, Brock Lesnar, it was good. But Shinsuke Nakamura and Bray Wyatt was a bit of shit. But thank you guys once again for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Tomorrow's video will be a bit different, okay? Um, either tomorrow's video will be uploaded today, but I'll talk to you guys about that in the next video. But yeah, thanks for watching. Do drop a like, and I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Peace out.